The borders of Palestine have indeed undergone significant changes throughout history, especially during the 20th century. In 1931, there were more than 850,000 Palestinian Arabs living in the region. However, the situation evolved with the increase in Jewish immigration, particularly due to the urgency caused by Hitler's rise in Europe. By the mid 20th century, the United Nations Special Committee proposed a partition plan for Palestine, suggesting it be divided into two states, one Jewish and one Arab. This proposal was within an area that already housed hundreds of thousands of Palestinian Arabs who had been living there for generations. Following this proposal, various Zionist paramilitary forces, including the Haganah, became prominent. The Haganah adopted Plan Dalla Plan D, which included instructions that led to the destruction of Arab villages through methods such as setting fires, blowing up buildings, and planting mines. This plan effectively became the blueprint for carrying out what is now recognized as ethnic cleansing in historic Palestine. As a result of these actions, approximately 750,000 Palestinians were forcibly expelled from their homes and more than 500 villages were destroyed. This period marks a significant and contentious chapter in the history of Palestine.